aftermarket car player and a look on it. A Kenwood head unit model number DNX 9180s the high range that had Garmin navigation. When he had bought the car by paying the deposits and making ourselves tied with a commitment via the bank monthly installation of the car and also with the insurance for the annual road tax and paying for the maintenance and repairing the car with the paint job for the minor or major accident to the car, we are expecting the best from the car that we had purchased. Unfortunately, the car manufacturer may have spent millions on the rand of the car but still, they seem car lovers who are dissatisfied with the car aspect, and wants more from it hence from here comes the car modification, where some car lovers love to install the performance exhaust pipe, stabilizer bar, bigger sports rim and tire, and many other. One of the things that may cause the most dissatisfaction for the car lovers is the head unit or the car players. The car player or head unit is the only source of the entertainment, for the car lovers while they are on the go and since the car head unit had been, upgraded to the infotainment as they are more function, to the head unit if compared in the past, hence the car lovers will expect the best of the head unit, according to the current situation. However, not all the car player is equipped with all function, and some head unit can be considered not up to the expected level or sluggish. Fortunately, there are many aftermarket branded car player, that is available for the car lovers to install as car audio manufacturers like Kenwood, Clarion, Sony, Nakamichi, Pioneer, Alpine, Clarion, JVC and many other had more features than some of the OEM function. Most of the aftermarket head unit had the latest sensation in the car Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, support mirroring via HDMI cable or air mirroring. Some of this car audio manufacturers like Kenwood, JVC and Pioneer had their own app called as Weblink for JVC and Kenwood and Radio app for Pioneer, where the car lovers can have the social media, YouTube, concierge service and many more via this app. This is something that is missing in the sum of the car OEM head unit especially the older head unit. A Kenwood head unit model number DNX 9180s the high range that had Garmin navigation. When talking on the price of the aftermarket audio JVC is the cheapest with all the functions, like Apple CarPlay, Android Auto and mirroring support, while Kenwood and Pioneer price depends on the series where the higher the series, the head unit will be more expensive. The most expensive aftermarket car player is Alpine where even a simple car player will cost more than RM2000. Alpine can be considered the Bentley and Rolls Royce of the head unit. Alpine head unit. With the price, it is an ultra-luxury head unit. Alpine and JVC meanwhile do not have the Garmin and the Papago navigation, however, the car lovers still can see their Waze navigation app displayed in the head unit via mirroring. Most of the aftermarket car head unit support mirroring via air mirroring, in the higher range while in the entry-level mirroring is via the HDMI cable. To change the OEM unit to the aftermarket, the car lovers need a special casing fixed and the car accessories maker, will need to make some wire harness while installing a smoker or making wire cut. Making a wire cut is risky for the new car owner as it can void the warranties if they are any faults founded due to change of player. Pioneer latest high-end model AVHC 9150BT supports air mirroring and wireless Apple CarPlay. They are some OEM head units too sold in the market where Block Punt, Kenwood, Pioneer, had the OEM player for Volkswagen, Toyota, and Honda respectively. Dynavin brand and the Alpine 2 is selling the OEM head unit for Honda HRV and other car models too. The OEM head unit is just plug and play and they are no special casing or wire harness involved in these hence it much safer and far better choice for those who will be worried about voiding the warranties of the car. A Honda HRV that is equipped with a non OEM that had the special casing fixed. Some car lovers may prefer to change to the OEM aftermarket player as it is just a plug and play where the non-OEM head unit will give an additional cost in the fixing the special casing, installing the socket, and also the labor fee. Some car accessories may recommend a wire harness to install the non-OEM aftermarket players, while some car accessories may recommend fixing the socket. Wire harness can affect the car warranties, however, if the car warranties had expired then this will be no issue at all. When comes to the wire harness, it is advisable for the car lovers to fix in a reputable and professional car accessory shop as some slight mistake from them will affect the car warranties. While the factory head unit may have some advantages, the limitation of these head units is the one that will make the car lovers replace their head unit. 
Some car lovers may want to upgrade their head unit in order to be with the current trend of the head unit, and some just want some satisfaction from having a better head unit than the factory head unit. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel.